Abusiafo enche ena abranti eye Kevin Taylor. Edi betu wa bwanti se wa uwo eye aburuchiri especially America ho. Na ube ye wabine se uko ye gana kade no. Yadu ube befi because emre bi aba. Na woman bi aba bwanti abe chiri e chile se obwa. Na woman anon se mwa oka no uhe ne ye usmiso ye lawyer. E wa chile chito anon su e chile mwa miye hunu adi kuinti ya Kevin obwa no. Uhe comment section ya woman anadi ya nasi ya nesa Amerika fo mi bina no e jitu mi se Dye Kevin e kano obwa. Nye mumu ebi yon pese nko ofo beye gana kad. E di ababe tuwa ba. Inti nebi ya oye sa education yon. E wane platform yon. Na mine platform yon minim se. E ti tiri wusu wosu wamo shepa. Inti minim alu kwenti ya. Omo eji sa ase mno e diye. Anyway. E nsembe na Kevin. E kan ye mra na o chile wane nkasa yimu. Se u nim na wako ye gana kada. Amerika fo no. Ebe de ube ko back to gana. Se nki se immigration fo. E shi ya wa. According to Kevin Taylor. Inse mwa okaye. Penefosi, bibiwa wea senti ni eda, ni atupunu, na nepaboni fonti. Anytime America policy bechi shabono, ana immigration bechi shabono, you will go home. Now when you read Potential Expatriating Act, ya se, diebe tu miyame yedu wako fiye, ena me kaya chila mono. Section 349 of the INA, that's 8 U.S.C. 1481, there's a document, there, a PDF there, as amended states that U.S. nationals are subject to loss of nationality if they perform certain specific, certain specific, specific dates, are voluntary with, with the intentions to relinquish U.S. nationality. Briefly stated, these acts include, almost say, we are U.S. citizen now. Nyame biwa obe ye ama US abayano IJ o citizenship every one simu no. Eni nyoma amu bebo bosui. One, obtain naturalization in a foreign state after the age of 18. Obtaining naturalization in a foreign state after the age of 18. So after the age of 18, uko kurobiso, eko jin nationality ya. So uwa US passport ha, omitu ma jifu unisemu. Akorebi ya below 18 bia uwa US, wako ya gana card no, the law can forgive that kid because ondu that age to make that decision. Na gane ni bia, watra 18 years no, ha wako ekurofo froso, ako je, oh specified acts, thank you very much. Uh, I think I need to get my, my glasses on. Specified act. I think they were both put together. Specified act. Now, who the 18 years? Now we are Ghana, New America. Now, so we to call Ghana. I call the Ghana card. Uh, I hear the sole document to show, say somebody is a Ghanaian. You have gone against the United States law. They can take your citizenship from you. It's okay. It's Kevin, Eddie Weber, to our one thing. And I hear a woman be M. So, I'm also a lawyer. Ono su ba bwantin e se obi chile mu ye e di a chile e ye gana fo a omu ye mu e shishi wo omu. E fa en se mwa e ye Kevin Taylor e di betu uja. Se uwo Amerika ho na ukura ho kura ta. Na ukwa ji gana kadi ya. Omi timi e di wako gana na ye mra e da wano. Wuma anon su be tina se e nyabu tre e chile chile mba ku miyo numi ya sentimi. Ti wuma anon su a wuma ya misu wa ye loya wo. Ye nti en se mwa wuma anon su e di betu uja o chile se unu ya en se mwa o kano e ya atro. Hello everyone, so I have received this video a few times and I wanted to share my thoughts on it. First of all, I would like you to note that there's actually a distinction under US immigration laws between denaturalization and expatriation. Denaturalization is um, where the US government actually takes you to court to take away your US citizenship um, because you for example, did not obtain your U.S. citizenship properly, or you've fallen under the grounds of denaturalization, you know, that make you um, a candidate for denaturalization proceedings. On the other hand, expatriation is a voluntary relinquishment of your U.S. citizenship. And also denaturalization proceedings happen in the U.S. Um, in court, expatriation it happens outside the U.S. You have to go to a U.S. embassy or consulate near you to voluntarily relinquish your U.S. citizenship. So those are the distinctions. Now, it's simply not true that 
being a Ghana card holder is a potentially expatriating act. Now, let's take a look at the U.S. Department of State's website, which discusses Section 349 of the Immigration and Nationality Act, and that discusses potentially expatriating acts. It states, U.S. nationals are subject to laws of nationality if they perform certain specified acts voluntarily and with the intention to relinquish U.S. citizenship. Briefly stated, these acts include, number one, obtaining naturalization in a foreign state after the age of 18. So guys, please note that um, the act alone that will trigger or that will rise to the level of an expatriating act is not sufficient, right? The act has to be coupled with the intention to relinquish U.S. citizenship. The act cannot stand alone. You have to perform the act along with the intention to relinquish citizenship. And so there's actually an administrative presumption of intent to retain U.S. citizenship. Even if you perform any act that... Um, can be said to be a potentially expatriating act um the u.s consular will then ask you you know do you intend to relinquish your u.s citizenship if you say no they will find that you have you know retained your u.s citizenship you see they they they, they want you to keep your u.s citizenship they love the fact that you're a u.s citizen right um so again Note that once you, um, the the fifth along with the fourteenth amendment of the U.S. Constitution, states that you cannot be deprived of life, liberty, and property without due process of law. So, it's simply not true that being a Ghana card holder will get you deported or can have them remove you from the U.S. Let's go back to the section, um, INA 349, obtaining naturalization in a foreign state after the age of 18 being a potentially expatriating act. Ghanaians who are Ghana cardholders are actually Ghanaians by descent. For example, their mother is a Ghanaian and so they are also Ghanaians from birth, right? So being a Ghana cardholder cannot be equated to obtaining naturalization in a foreign state after the age of 18. That is, um, you know, a misinterpretation of of U.S. immigration law. In Tino Maminka Ochimu, Ukra Ghana card, the Nyam password, the Kufi also. Um, in order to relinquish, Upe say, Ujaiwu U.S. citizenship, ma, a so ye BB. Now, Sanso, wa Jane is your own pay U.S. citizenship, Nibium. In Tino, you know, it's just not true that, you know, just by virtue of the fact that you are a Ghana card holder and you are you haven't applied for dual citizenship you can be deported you you will not be deported in order for you to be deported as a u.s citizen it's more complex than that you have to be you have to go through denaturalization proceedings and that you'll go through you know court right and the the, the u.s government has to prove their case um either by clear, convincing, and unequivocal evidence or beyond every reasonable doubt, depending on the circumstances surrounding how you triggered the denaturalization grounds. So I hope this clarifies a little bit. My name is A.K. Puku. Follow me for more. Okay. Eti, ya mame opuku. Ena abichiri mu ediachire Amerika fu. Se ensema uni akano eya atoro. And this is how we be here. ukura a ye Ghana card ya. Ye ye shia wa ye biti midu wako fi niya di a di biya. E ye bo siri muka. Ana wu niya aboli siri mua. O kane niya breno hosa. Inti e niya di biya ye ye biya ye ye biya. Inti ye mame ye da onzo wase. Se onzo wa chiri chiri mu. E di achere Amerika fo. Na mi nimse Amerika fo onzo beti asye. Na e nye sa neti e yontro. Ana wu niya ke wun tela. O sheno sempo sempo sa anu. Wait me to comment about. Penny for say, be blue, we are sent in your da, near Tupunu, Nani Paponi Fonti, and what's some more bamboo here? Nani Papa Mudia, Pro Technologies, and I make up for my work. Pro. 
technologies. We are specialized in both sales and installation of CCTV cameras. Yet on SI install CCTV cameras in the sour gun and as a brochure now if you gun now pursue a CCTV camera installation. We need pro technologies and in our so we use CCTV camera installation, electric fence, automated gate, access control, video doorbell, and our intercom, and our satellite TV, home theater, so we pay and our water and our person installing my pro technologies and our software. Nashenso. Say if you didn't name for America but you may decide to pop up now Pedia. Man, you know, none of one suit that form. Make sure you know the web which memo any branch and organa. You need more brow brain into sick of fire and sem. Say if any of your padema organa or da. Nani ya tenese, yesa ya general construction. So we brochure, na peso si fi organa. E da yi plan biya peso si. Se wa sha si dada, anafe na peso si. Plan biya, yebisi ya mao. Enu ya chiso ya solar power. Anabamba huwa nsense mdi adye. Wani ya nisa wa so. Ni esansu ya smart home. Apa ya fun fidi ya biya peso si she. E wo fi, anawa chuma mwa dema wo. Wani ya nisa wa so. We are just a call away. Ni esansu wa dena dema hain. Anafe brochure bedu gana. Na upe full house, room, ana apartment ha hain. For short term and a long term, you be more beyond the border form. Now, Bamba won't send you. Man, you know, and now you're in Syria and the creation. So, as if you're in a re, and now you're still feeling a mound, you sign the creation. You best see you'll be an hour officer at the amount. And ready so what don't you be? Now, who can first install it? And now the settings, you bear at the amount. Our Ghana, Uber Huyang, when we're off for dental, Edward Yacha Dodoa, Uber Huyang, our Ashi, Yeni Emmaline Pharmacy, and what the same building for information or what's up? 401 Zero and a plus four zero one six nine nine two two five four. Pro Technologies, we have the solutions for your security and home entertainment needs at affordable prices.